Hello guys, I'm Radwan and I'm here today to speak about how to dockerize a mean stack application. First of all, we will start by dockerize Angular application. Second, we need to dockerize the Express API application. And finally, we need to dockerize the MongoDB database using Docker Compose. So, the first step is come here and create a new file this is our docker file first of all we need an image base so using from instruction we will need to use node 8.11.2 alpine as node we need as node because we will need this instruction in the next stage. This is the first stage. Now we need to create a work directory in our container. So we need work div and our path is user src. App. Okay. Now we need to copy the package.json from our host to our container. So we need to use the copy instruction to copy package.json from our local machine to the work directory. Second we need to install npm globally so using the command line run to npm install npm and install the latest version now we have a list of dependency in our package.json like here we have a dev dependency for development mode and we have a list of dependency for production mode so we need to use the command line run to make npm install and now what we need is copy this folder content angular app from our host to the working directory so we need to use the command line copy from our local host to the uh, container user src app and finally run the command line npm run build when we come to this instruction npm run build you go to package.json scripts and run this command ng build minus minus production after this is instruction you will give a dist folder that have all gs javascript files now the second stage is to copy this dist folder from user src application to nginx web server so we need to base it to another image nginx 2.1 13.12 alpine and copy this user src app the dist folder from the container node to the next container nginx this is the two stage first stage and second stage use it 
to minimize the size of our container because first of all we need to install dependency like node modules etc and after we create all this content and we have a dist so we have a lot of files our container need to be light so we need just to copy this result dist from the first stage to the next stage in our nginx web server so first of all copy minus minus from the first stage the first stage is node and copy user src app this when we need to copy we need to copy this to user share nginx html so we need to copy to user share nginx and html after we have here uh, nginx configuration that we point from the data entry to and search the index.html if index.html not found we give a 404 page not found so we need to copy this copy from dot nginx.conf to etc nginx conf dot d and default dot conf this is so our docker file for the angular application what we need now is to build an image based in this docker file so go to integrated terminal and here just docker build minus t to give an image uh, name and tag to our docker image like here angular app 2.1.0 and the location or the path of our docker file this is we are now in the, the same directory or in the current directory so we need add point to give uh, information that we are in the same folder ls uh, sorry we need to copy this to this let's move and now and this is our image start as you can see our image is does not found locally so we download first of all the image node 8.11.2 alpine and after we will create a working directory copy package point json from our host to the container user src application run npm install to upgrade the latest version of node.js npm install to install all dependency here from our package point json after copy the angular application content from our path here to the working directory after run our application in production like here ng build minus minus prod after for the second stage we will base it in nginx web server and copy the result from the first stage to user share nginx.html after we copy the nginx configuration our image build take a few time so this is all for today thanks for watching and see you in the next video about how to dockerize an express application 
using docker file thanks bye bye